really don't deserve this. 75 degrees, 10 to 15 knots, just beautiful. We are officially three weeks away from the Savannah Yacht Club Early Spring Foiling Rally 2023. I can't wait. And I just have a couple of things to share. Uh, first off, if you have not registered, please register. Uh, it's helping me uh, immensely with the head count, uh, with for food, for the number of launches, uh, just for our general footprint on the ground. So uh, please register so that I can uh, lock that in uh, with the club. Uh, the second thing is just a small thing for everyone who's coming is I realize that most of you guys are beach launched and you've got the beach dolly, you clip into those little loops on the, on the uh, side of the hulls. Um, we're going to be dock launched here, which I think you're going to come to realize is fantastic. It's really convenient, really easy, you know, no gradual lowering of the rudder, just full drop of the rudder, full drop of the foil, and away you go. Now, um, one thing that I would ask for you guys to be on the lookout for is if you can, try to find a spare line so you can hook up a painter, or rather uh, a bridle. Um, and if you can, put clips on it so it's quick release, quick attach. Um, and for a while I used those little plastic things that, you use, that came with the beach dolly, but I've since upgraded to some uh, uh, stainless steel lightweight ones, and they work great. Um, but having a bridle uh, really facilitates controlling your boat on the on the dock, and it's got the uh, I'll show you my boat right here. It's got the added benefit of giving you an easy uh, tie down method, and you literally can just leave your boat there, go away, grab lunch, have a beer, take a break, say hi to your family. And then before you go uh, out foiling again. So it's very useful for a lot of reasons. If you need a tow, um, you just give it to your, uh, give it to the, the launch, the chase boat. Mine is long enough that it extends out beyond the sprit, which again, I think would be helpful for a tow if and when you need it. Um, anyway, I've got some spare lines here. I'm happy to help. Uh, for anyone that, that thinks they're, they're going to need one. Um, but if you can, before you come, that's just uh, one of the things uh, you can help yourself with is uh, figure out a painter or a bridle. All right. Again, I'm talking too long and I'm getting antsy because I want to go foiling. I am not going to let uh, this beautiful afternoon go to waste. So can't wait to see you guys in three weeks. And I gotta say this, cause I know people are gonna make fun of me. So I'm getting ready to put on a dry suit. Water's about uh, 55 degrees. Totally could do it in a wetsuit. It'd be probably more comfortable in a wetsuit. But the, I, I've got some errands to run immediately after this. So peeling off a dry suit and hopping in the car and driving away is it's too convenient for me to, to pass up. So don't laugh, I'm in a dry suit. <laughs> 